<laughs> what? Do you know what's coming? Oh. <laughs> Good morning, guys, and welcome back to my channel. And bringing you another dental school vlog today. I know I've been bad about filming these, but I just don't know how vloggers do it. I don't like to like follow my life around with a camera like every single day. Occasionally it's nice, but you know. So I thought I would have class in person at 8 a.m. this morning. It is a Wednesday, by the way, uh, but they just moved my 8 a.m. class online. So it's 7.57 right now, so we're gonna do like a WebEx class thing at 8. And then I have another class at 10, still deciding if I'm gonna go in person or not. I do like to go in person, usually for this class. And then I have dentures lab all afternoon where we'll be setting some denture teeth. So exciting stuff. I'm kind of at a good place right now in school because I haven't had any exams um, the past two weeks, or I guess just like this week and the next, I don't have any major exams. So it's been nice and I'll have to like, you know, study every single day. And then tomorrow and Friday I have clinic. So I can't really like film a clinic, but usually I like update you guys about how my day went, if I did anything exciting. Lately I've been doing some like semi-exciting stuff. So that's all we have going on. I'm in my study sweats, got some tea, and I'm gonna tune into my first class. So it's 8.03 and the PowerPoint has not been uploaded and neither has the WebEx link. So class is going great so far. Um, sometimes I don't understand how we can be almost done with the semester and they still can't figure out how to do it, but. Okay, done with that class, and I'm gonna grab my breakfast. Basically, that was just like a guest lecture on infection control, which like we've already had an entire course on infection control, but okay. Having my overnight oats for breakfast. These look a little different than usual because I actually used the vegan protein. This bad boy right here, it's the iced oatmeal cookie one. It's actually pretty good. Um, I don't usually eat vegan protein because I'm usually fine with whey, especially the first form whey. It doesn't usually bother my stomach or anything. But this one's actually pretty good. You just have to add a lot more water, or in my case, almond milk than usual because it thickens up a lot, which if you like thick oats. But yeah, I just added a little cinnamon on top. So if you've been looking for a good vegan protein, um, I actually like the iced oatmeal cookie one. It still has some of the qualities of a vegan protein, like a little chalkier than a whey protein, but it's a lot better than a lot of other vegan proteins I've had, so. Now I need to complete some stuff on Axiom for some of my patients, so I'm gonna do that, and then I have to get ready to go in person to class at 10 o'clock. Where'd you go with the hitchhike? Are you playing with it on the bed, silly? Are you doing that? Yeah. Let's go. Oh, oh. Let's go play. Let's go play. Ready? Go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you too good for this? <laughs> Sniff the camera watch, silly. Mento, are you bringing it back to me? No, you're, you're taking it for yourself. All right. Very interesting. Can I have it? Look at those eyes. Look at him. Oh. <laughs> All right, packing up my lunch. I got this little cheese square, a banana, these little mint dark chocolate stars from Trader Joe's. Probably too many of them now that I look at it. And then my lunch in here, I'll show you what I eat, is like some chicken, potatoes, and uh, broccoli. So go pack this up, head to class.
from a long day of class. Actually, it wasn't even that long. It's just that dentures just really wipes me out. Hey, Panto. Peach. Peach. <laughs> this is how Peach um, covers her litter. She really, she really thinks that she is covering her litter. <laughs> her pee in the litter box right now. Peach. So I set the upper teeth, no problem. But the lower teeth, they have to like fit in perfectly with the upper teeth. I know it's like obvious and it seems like, yeah, of course it does, but it's just like really hard and really tedious. And I'm really tired of doing it. And we're almost done. And I just like hate setting these denture teeth so much. In the real world, sure you can set your own denture teeth or you just send them to a lab and have someone do it for you. And how I see it, my time is very valuable and I'm not gonna spend four hours setting teeth. Like, just send it off somewhere. I'm gonna have a snack right now. Um, I got my Buff Bunny packages for the Black Friday launch, so I'm gonna do a little IG Live unboxing. I've never done one of those. It's gonna be weird. And I think I'm gonna make myself some tea. <laughs> hey, guys. So I filmed my Buff Bunny Live, we ate dinner. Oh, I guess I didn't show my dinner, but we had crab cakes, it was good. Now I'm having my greens and reds. I actually didn't have these yesterday because I have like the little, little issue with like my tongue right now and the acidity was hurting it. So I'm hoping the straw helps. But of course I didn't have them yesterday and then today I'm like not feeling 100%. This happens every time I skip my greens and reds. It's not that I noticed so much the difference of taking these like when I'm taking them, it's when I forget to take them for like one or two days that I'm like, okay, regrets. I need to be taking these. So now I'm gonna reply to some DMs and some messages. I don't really have a lot of schoolwork to do. I have like one little assignment I need to do like before Friday, ideally. It's not due Friday, but I just wanna get it done for the weekend. And then we might be going to get some Somi Somi ice cream. So stay tuned. So I'm meal prepping that part of my lunch for tomorrow just because I will not be home, so I'm meal prepping. So I'm just making some of these roasted potatoes, gonna cook them up in the air fryer. If you do not have an air fryer, you are missing out. It's like my favorite kitchen appliance. And then I'm also going to just microwave some broccoli and then also air fry some of these like panko crusted chicken breasts we got. Kind of an easy lunch this week, kind of sucks. I have to cook it like every night before. I guess I could have cooked them all in advance, but my air fryer isn't that big, so we're just gonna do that. Packing up my lunch and snacks for the day. For my lunch, I have the chicken, potatoes, and broccoli I made last night. For a snack, I have a whole honey crisp uh, for a little dessert, I have this little cookie thing that Ian got yesterday. And then I have my German chocolate cake, overnight oats. So yeah, that's all I have for lunch. I also made myself a little tea for the morning. Also, not like my best. Um, I wasn't feeling 100% this morning. I was gonna go to the gym new gym outfit that I was gonna wear and it's gonna be exciting and then and then I just like was not feeling it and usually I just ignore when I'm not feeling really good to go to the gym but not like sick not feeling good you know just like not feeling 100% but I feel like I've just been 
pushing myself a lot lately and I needed to just take a day off. So that's what we did. I'm going to clinic today. In the morning, I'm assisting one of my classmates on a cleaning. And then in the afternoon, I'm assisting a restoration filling situation. So should be fun. Clinic's always kind of nice because I don't have to like sit in class all day. You're actually like doing stuff. So I got home early, kind of didn't do anything. Sorry, Peach is outside and I'll go sit out here with her because she's excited. Peach! So yeah, the patient I was assisting in the afternoon canceled, so that's why I'm home at like 1.30. Kind of nice to have a little free afternoon. I've been a little tired today. And in the morning, I just assisted on the cleaning and it was a little slow, a little boring, but we made it through. So hopefully tomorrow's a little more exciting. You ready to go outside too? You ready to go outside too? Hopefully tomorrow is a little more exciting. I have to check what I'm scheduled to do so far. I think I am scheduled. I just haven't checked the schedule yet. So today I'm just gonna work on getting ahead of some assignments I have due next week. I have kind of a busy weekend of filming for like Black Friday stuff. So I need to make sure I can get all my work done ahead of time so I don't have to focus on that this weekend. All right, clearly we're eating healthy this week, but we got tacos for dinner because we felt like eating something not super healthy. So I got um, carne asada tacos with rice and beans, the best part, and we're gonna watch some kind of show with it. Okay, just got back from my workout and I am glad I worked out today because this outfit had me feeling like an ice queen. I was here for it. And now I need to quickly get ready for class because it's like 8.05 and I like to cut it close. All right, so it's like five o'clock. I just got back from clinic. Oh, Peach is coming to join. Peach, no one's gonna judge my hair because I've been at a scrub cat for the past two days. But yeah, just assisted on a cleaning this morning. So kind of boring again, but I did assist on a restoration this afternoon. I got to do the injection again. We just had a local injection right over the molar. It was kind of a deep filling to do because it was replacing an old one and it was like almost near the pulp, but she didn't expose the pulp, so that was good. And this is like the second time someone has asked me if I was an assistant before dental school because I'm so good at assisting. No, actually I wasn't. Honestly, like my most exciting part of the week is assisting. So I was pretty bad at it at first, honestly, or no one told me I was bad, but I felt like I didn't really know what I was doing. And I really try to pay attention and think of what they may need next. So I'm glad that my hard work's paying off and that I'm actually being helpful because that's all I'm trying to do. I'm just trying to be helpful. So yeah, it's definitely good to hear that I was good because I also feel like if they trust you as an assistant, like they let you do more, like sometimes the fourth years can like let you do some of the stuff that like they're supposed to be doing in the appointment. So like if there's ever a filling that they're like, hey, do you want to do this. Another thing is I always say yes. Anything they ask me to do, even if I don't feel 100% confident, because honestly, I'm never going to feel 100% confident until I actually do it for like multiple times. So there has to be a first time for everything. So anytime someone asks me, hey, do you want to do this injection? I just say yes. And then I just say like, you know, kind of ask them to walk me through it and stuff. I'm really trying to get out of my comfort zone. All right, probably not doing anything exciting tonight. Just going to relax. And then I have a lot of filming and stuff to do this weekend. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment down below what videos you want to see coming up. And if you made it this far, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!